Dear Diary, yesterday my friends had the wild idea of making me spy on Mason. And the worst thing is, I actually did it. But hey, I, at least I found out some more information on him. So that's good, I guess. Ugh, I can't forget the fact that I was basically becoming a Berday 2.0. And to make it worse, later that night, someone unexpectedly paid me a visit. But anyways, here's what happened. Oh my god, you guys are back. How was the cruise? Tell me everything. Yeah, we're finally back, but honestly, it was so much fun. I mean, there was some random situations that happened. Oh my god, it was so much fun. There was so much food. Oh, I wish you would have came. Oh, that sounds like so much fun, especially the food. Maybe next time I can come. For sure. Like, oh my gosh, we should plan another cruise. And next time we can go on the Disney one. Those are the best. Uh, yeah, bestie, I'm gonna go if you pay me. Because, girl, you know I'm broke. I don't got money like that, okay? Yeah, same. Don't worry, besties. I got y'all. As long as we have fun, that's what matters. So, did you guys meet any cute boys on the cruise? Uh, kind of. I mean, I saw my ex, June. I mean, we never really dated. Bella, stop lying. You know you was all booed up with him. You was like, mm, I love you. I love him too. Mm. Ah! No, I was not, okay? Most of the time, I was just raging at him. Hold up. The guy that Ooh. broke your heart is just casually on the cruise? Yeah, I don't know how the heck this happened. Girl, you almost kissed him, okay? And if it wasn't for you for seeing me in your visions, as you should. Well, I guess, Phantom, you do haunt me. Girl, I'll be doing you a favor, especially when I'm not around. Oh, my God. The tea is boiling. What about you, Phantom? Did you meet anybody? Nah, the only thing that I met was my food. But anyways, Bella, tell Kitty about the time that you got stuck into the elevator, huh? With the hot boy Mason Sterling. Wait, what? Uh, now you're putting me on the spot. I don't even like him. And he keeps calling me a watermelon head. Like, bro, what does that mean? Do I have like a big head or something? Is it my forehead? <laughs> I'll be like, Bella, your forehead is fine. It sounds like this guy has a crush on you if he keeps teasing you and calling you names. Yeah, for real. That's what I keep saying. You guys are delusional. But anyways, I don't even know anything about Mason's personal life. So how would I even like him and how would he even like me bestie you're lying i bet you know so many things about him not really to be honest i just know anastasia described him to be this perfect man but he's not girl do you want to find out information about him i have something to help what do you mean find out information about him like literally once i tried googling him and nothing appeared okay not even a single picture you guys always forget i'm literally a hacker i have a lab downstairs so we can look up stuff especially stuff that's encrypted isn't that a <gasps> oh my god, I actually have a really good idea. After we gather all the information, what you should do is go and spy on him personally. That's such a good idea. Then you can see what he's like in his day-to-day -day life. I mean, me as a spy, that's kind of crazy. I mean, I did pretend to be a guy once. So maybe it could have worked, but I don't know. What if I get caught? I'll take care of it for you. Don't worry about it. I guess I'm in. I mean, as long as I can learn his deepest, darkest secret. Oh, but that's kind of invasion of privacy. Girl, whatever. Let's go to my lab. Follow me, guys. Oh, okay. What's this? You have like a library? Girl, this is not a library. There's a secret room in here. <laughs> yeah, it makes sense that it's not an actual library. Wow, Bessie, are you saying she doesn't read? For your information, Phantom, I do read. That's how I can hack into different places. Yeah, Bestie, she's smart. Anyways, follow me, guys. Okay, let's see. And here we go. Ta-da! <gasps> okay, show us the secret base. Okay, it's just down here. We have to go one more level. This looks kind of creepy, though. Do you have like a hack? Hacker club or something? Actually, yeah, I do. Oh my gosh, one day you should have me and Phantom learn how to be hackers and like hacker suits and stuff. <laughs> yes, I could totally do that. You guys would look so cute in your hacker suit. All right, guys, follow me. Just come through the wall. Uh, um, it's just a wall. What? Where do you go? Watch your step. Ah! Okay, that totally does not concern me. Fine, I'll go down. Oh, is this where you do all your hacking and stuff? Yeah, this is my secret lab. Nobody knows about that except you guys. Okay, we won't say anything. Let's get started. Let me just get my cute outfit on. <gasps> oh my god i want one me too also how the heck oh my gosh uh, anyways what's his name again mason sterling associated to anastasia sterling they're hot rich people so just look that up too okay hot rich people oh yeah they do come up the sterlings they're right here oh they're live pretty close to here probably like 30 minutes? Oh, yeah, the Sterling's home. Yeah, I've, I've been there. Um, I think Anastasia has, like, seven houses, though. Do you want me to look up 
all of their houses i could just do it real quick and i could give you the addresses too wouldn't that be like too stalkerish and like invasion of privacy it's okay i'm not gonna pull up her day yeah please do not be like per day but bella aren't you gonna go spy on him i see a security gate here but i could probably disable it so you can go through oh my gosh yes last time i went to their house they thought i was like a poor person and they didn't want to let me in oh my god how dare they is there any information on mason or something uh, let me check let me just click here yeah here he is i have all his information i feel like he would hate me if he knew that i was trying to find his information girl he already hates you actually with his phone number here it shows him at a different location it looks like an apartment in the city what an apartment i thought he lived most of the time with anastasia oh my god does he secretly have like a girlfriend or something him with a girlfriend that's whatever but like still why would he lie about it then it sounds like someone is jealous bro me jealous bro are you crazy i'm not jealous but i'm just like concerned because why would he lie about that maybe you should like go check it out what if i get caught don't worry girl i'm gonna set you guys up with walkie talkies and i'm gonna guide you along the way oh my god we're gonna be totally spies i mean that does sound kind of fun well if you guys are gonna go you better hurry because according to this data he returns back to the main house like soon well i'll do it then come on here's a walkie talkie just press this button i'm gonna be on the whole time and i'm gonna guide you through it so that you don't get caught and if there's any like security gates or something like that yeah that's super easy i can totally do that just make sure you don't get caught or else he's never gonna like you well i'll go with that okay i'll keep talking to you guys on the mic bye guys wish me luck bye bella good luck bye bestie good luck okay now i need to find this address okay i need to hurry up and get there i'm kind of nervous what am i gonna find there i just hope i don't get caught oh well let's go uh, all right i'll just read this last chapter then i gotta head back to the house uh, but this book is just too good i don't know why people watch useless entertainment instead of educating themselves everyone should strive to be just like albert einstein uh, love that guy okay so according to the gps i'm here kitty phantom am i in the right place can you check hmm, we're looking it up right now yeah it looks like you're at the right place it's just the, it's the stairs what floor is it on looks like it's on the third floor the penthouse the most expensive one just check if someone's home oh i'm so nervous guys okay try not to be loud we don't want to get caught wait a second i see a hand hey i think that's mason Ugh, what is that sound at my door there's so many barbarians in this city i got my own private apartment and a man can't even read in peace still but i can't really see up close there's like a wall blocking the view well according to the positioning system it looks like he has a balcony i think he could probably look at it through there you mean like climb and, and try to like sneak up but it's three floors what if i fall or something i see stop complaining that is yo man you need to go and get him no he's not i don't even like him i'm just doing this to find out information about him Cassie, then you're doing a little bit too much for someone you don't even like oh shut up i'm muting this how the heck am i gonna climb up there i mean i'm pretty good at gymnastics i can probably climb or something <gasps> oh my gosh how the heck did i get up here okay guys i managed to get on top of something but i'm still like one floor below his balcony girl just be careful we don't want you to get hurt girl you're committed i would not do that for anybody i got this <gasps> oh my gosh okay i need to be careful if I fall down, this is gonna be a really hard fall. Okay, but one more floor and I'm gonna be- oh, oh my gosh! Girl, you're struggling. You need to go to the gym. Wow, I'm trying my best, okay? I finally made it up here. Oh my gosh, this is really high up. I think I'm kind of crazy. Uh, you think? <laughs> Ugh, you sound like Anastasia. I don't even know her and already I love her. If this plan goes right and I don't get caught, then I'll have you meet her. Ooh, what's this? What was that? Was that a big bird in my window? I need to move out of Brookhaven. Ugh, this place is way too weird. Let me check what's making all that noise. Wait, I think he's coming. Oh my gosh. Guys, I almost got caught. What the heck was that? Whoever's out there, or if you're a bird, I'll find you. Hmm, I guess it's nothing. Oh my gosh, he's literally right there. I almost got caught. Ugh. It doesn't matter anymore. I don't have that much time. I had to head back to the house before Anastasia calls the FBI. Oh, she does that way too much. Guys, I don't know if I should be doing this. I literally almost got caught. Bella, you have to hurry up. He's gonna probably be heading to the main house and Anastasia too. Anastasia's gonna be there? Okay, good. In case I get caught, I'll just say I was there for her. Where the heck is Mason? Ooh, this place is nice. Really fancy and clean. I'm surprised. Usually guys are slobs. Where the heck is he? Oh my gosh. Is that a security camera? Kitty, 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 kitty. I have a problem. He has security cameras installed. I need you to delete the footage or else I'm gonna get caught. Girl, I 
disabled the security cameras a long time ago. You're good. Oh my gosh. Okay, thank God. Because I almost had a heart attack. Wait a second. I think I see him. He's in the bathroom. Hey, okay, maybe I shouldn't be looking. That's kind of weird. Anyways, I need to hide. Uh, I forgot to get my clothes. What's wrong with me? What am I feeling today? Maybe red? Yeah, I think Anastasia will like that. All right, let me just grab this and I just go take a quick shower. Hey, where the heck did he go? Oh, I need to be careful. This ledge is really thin. I don't want to fall. Oh my gosh, that was a close one. But anyways, where the heck is he? <gasps> There he is. Oh my gosh. Should I be looking at this? Also, what the heck? Is he talking to himself? What is he even saying? Hey, Kitty, do you think you can kind of like do something so I can hear his audio? Ooh, I can hack into his house audio and then you can hear him there. Okay, perfect. I want to see what he's saying about himself. Wow, I'm looking really good. Maybe Anastasia was right. I should have been a model. Ugh, but that's boring. Oh my god, look at my abs. I guess working out does pay off. Uh, he is not saying that about himself. Okay, let's go shower. I think I'm taking way too long. Teardrops could be bottled. There'll be swimming pools. Oh my gosh, he looks really nice when he's showering. Oh my god, wait, what is happening? I'm turning into Brede. I should not be doing this. Wait a second, is it just me or his singing kind of reminds me of the guy from the Masquerade Ball? Eh, whatever. It's just Mason. Ugh, why did Anastasia buy me girl body wash? I'm gonna smell like a girl now. Wait, is this watermelon? It kinda smells like Bella. How do I remember what Bella smells like? Okay, this is getting a little weird. I gotta go. Oh, wait, I think he's getting out. Let me hide. Did I hear something from my window? What is going on today? I swear, if it's that bird again, I'll find you. Oh my god, he almost saw me. Girl, you need to start being more careful. Tell me about it. I mean, I'm trying. All right, there we go. Much better. Now to add some cologne. Maybe it'll hide the scent of watermelon. We'll see. Ah, there we go. This smells so good. Bella, Bella, I think we're losing signal. Wait, but how am I gonna enter the main house? Don't worry, I already unlocked it. You should be okay. Okay, thank you then. I'll see you guys later, okay? Okay, perfect. You got this. Just don't get caught, bestie. Okay, I won't. Also, you need to hurry up because Anastasia's gonna be in there in an hour. I better start heading out now. I think I'm wasting too much time. I don't want Anastasia knowing I have a private apartment oh wait a second he's probably heading out to the main house oh i should get back to my car before he sees it okay i should be quick oh my gosh ah! oh my gosh my bad oh, i think this is karma i should have been stalking him who the heck parked their car in front of an apartment complex this is illegal why am i getting the feeling that i've seen this car before it kind of looks like bella's what is going on today Ugh, whatever Wow, I need to clean my car. Oh my gosh, I think he's like right next to me. Oh, let me stand up. I, I don't want to get caught. Ow. Wait, did I just hear something? Oh my god, I swear if it's that bird again, I should head out. I don't want to get assaulted. I need to hurry up and head to the main house. Ow, my back and foot hurts. Ugh, did I bruise my arm? I better hurry up. Hopefully I don't crash into something. Oh, I'm finally here. Good thing Anastasia is not home. Finally, some peace and quiet. Ooh, speaking of quiet, I can read my book. Oh, but it's getting a little hot in here. How about I go read this book outside? Ah, oh, finally. Yes, I should really write a review on this. Oh, I love this kind of literature. So wise. Okay, good thing Kitty just activated the security gate. Okay, I'm gonna leave my car here because I don't want to get caught. Okay, now where the heck is Mason? Look, his car's here. He's already there. Wait, where's Anastasia? I don't think she's arrived yet. Too bad this walkie-talkie doesn't work and now I can't talk to them. Uh, but whatever, I'll find him myself. Okay, is he in here? Not in the bathroom. Uh, maybe he's outside touching grass. Me and him are too different. I barely touch grass. So I wouldn't be surprised if he does. <gasps> Look, oh my gosh, he's there. Why is he always reading? Such a nerd. How many chapters do I have left? Us. Uh, oh. 100 chapters, really? So little. I'll be sure to put that into the review. Bella, I got it back and running again. It's working. Oh my god, Bessie, you just jump scared me. How the heck did you fix it? I just smacked it around a little bit. <laughs> Anyways, where are you, bestie? Um, I'm currently at the main Sterling house. I'm watching Mason read a random book. I don't know why everybody's into him. He's like so basic. Oh, shut up, girl. You know he's mysterious. You're literally stalking him. Shut up. Don't remind me. I need to be silent. He's not that far from me. I don't want to get caught. Wait a second. Where the heck did he go? I mean, is he in the room or something? Hey, he's not there either. Bestie, I don't know where he went. Found you, little bird. Ah! Oh my gosh. What the heck are you doing here? What are you talking about, Bella? You're at my house. Are you stalking me? No. What are you talking about? What, what do you mean stalking? Um, I'm here for Anastasia. Bella, 
Anastasia isn't even home. But she said uh, for me to come here. Are you sure about that, Bella? Or are you just lying? I I'm, I'm not lying, Mason. No, Bella. If you wanted to pay me a visit, you could have just asked. Oh my gosh. Why is he so close to me? This is not necessary. No, I I'm not visiting you. So tell me, Isabella, why are you actually here? Oh my gosh. Did he just call me by my full name? What the heck? Um, how do you know my name is Isabella? Bella, it's so obvious. Oh yeah, right. Fine. Um, I I'll, s I'll tell you the truth. So I'm actually here because... Because, you know, at the elevator, we said that we we're gonna be doing a day where we, like, play games and battle each other. Bella, don't play games with me. Why are you actually here? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, why is he so close to me? He barely breathes. He does kind of smell good. It smells like watermelon. But he's so close! Bella, I'm waiting for your answer. Uh, I don't know why my heart is beating so fast. <laughs> Not for Mason. What's wrong, Bella? Did I leave you speechless? No, sorry. I, I just zoned out for a second. By zoning out, I mean freaking out because he's too close to me. And Bella, what's wrong with your arm? There's a bruise on it. Did someone hurt you? Tell me who did it, and I'll fight them. No, nobody hurt me. I just fell. Are you sure, Bella? You don't need to lie to me. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm not lying to you. And besides, why do you care? I don't care. I'm just being a gentleman, all right? What the hell are you guys doing? Oh, Anastasia. Good afternoon. Don't good afternoon me. What is going on here? I'm, I'm here to see you, Anastasia. Uh, don't you remember? Oh, uh, yes, yes. Actually, she did come here for me. Man, I could have sworn Bella was trying to stalk me. Maybe she wanted to hang out or something. I guess not. Anyways, Bella, meet me in the kitchen in two minutes. Say your farewells to Mason. So, Mason. So, Bella. Um, are we still gonna do our arcade battle thing or something? How about we set a date? Wait, you wanna go on a date with me? No, um, a date to play arcade games. Oh, you mean like the day and time. Uh, okay. How does next weekend sound? That, that sounds good. Wait, give me your number just so I can call or text you whenever I need you. Wait, oh my gosh. Is he asking me for my number? Oh, it's just a number. I'm just overreacting. Um, this is my number. Okay, let me save yours. Okay, there we go. Text me whenever. Yeah, maybe I will. Good. Good. Okay, well, I have to go. Bye, Mason. Bye, watermelon head. Oh, don't call that. You know you like it. Oh, shut up. Oh, hey, Anastasia. Sorry if I took a bit. So, Bella, please explain to me why I had to lie to my cousin. What are you even doing here? Should I actually tell you or should I not? Yes, please. Enlighten me. Okay, fine. I'll tell you. But don't tell Mason. I was kind of like spying on him. I don't know why. First of all, I am very disappointed in you, Bella. Why would you spy on my cousin? If you really wanted to spy on him, you could have just asked. I would have guessed helped you. Wait, you would have helped me? Of course! I want you guys to get married and have blue-eyed baby. Oh, of course. How could I forget? Next time you plan a crazy scheme, I want in. <laughs> I'll be sure to tell you. But please don't tell Mason. I don't know how he'd react if he found out I was stalking him. Girl, are you stupid? I don't ever break girl code. That is the number one rule. Well, anyways, I have to go, Anastasia. But thank you so much for being really chill. And also... Make sure to get ready for the party that's coming up in a couple of weeks. There's going to be a lots of rich people, so make sure to look good. Oh, yeah, the party. I forgot about that. But okay, I'll make sure to look my best. And you can also send me some Pinterest outfit ideas if you want. But anyways, I have to go. Bye. Bye, American. Uh, well, that was a close one. Oh, oh my gosh, today was such a long day. I can't believe Phantom and Kitty actually convinced me to go and spy on Mason. And I can't believe I actually did it. Kind of crazy. I can't believe I got caught. That is like so embarrassing. Mason probably thinks I'm like a weirdo or something. He's probably never gonna want to speak to me again. You know what? I'm just being dramatic. I mean, we do have our arcade date. I mean, hangout coming up soon. Oh, why did I say date? Oh my god, what is wrong with me? He's never gonna want to go on a date with me. Now I don't want to go on a date with him. Yeah, this is just us being competitive. You know what? It's whatever. But anyways, I should start getting ready to go to bed. It's getting kind of late and my back hurts. Ow. You know what? That's what I get for pulling a birthday. It's stalking people. Speaking about birthday, I can't can't believe he hasn't stalked me in a week. He actually kept his word. Why do I kind of miss him stalking me? Ugh, that's kind of weird. Uh, but anyways, I should start getting ready to go to bed. And why is it raining so much? I don't know how people like sleeping with rain. It just reminds me of thunderstorms. Sky, please stop leaking. Okay, let me go brush my teeth because I do not want cavities. Okay, let me get my toothbrush. There we go. Sheesh, my teeth are nice. I guess one year of braces was worth it. <coughs> 
my god. I think I swallowed toothpaste. No, whatever. Wait a second. What's all that noise outside? Is someone calling my name? Bella. Bella, it's me, June. Open up. Open the door. I'm getting drenched here. Please open. Wait a second. Is that June? June Valentine? What the heck is he doing here? Wait, let me check. Uh, June? Um, what are you doing here in the middle of the night? I came to see you, silly. I missed you. You miss me? It's only been like two weeks since the cruise. You could have just texted me before you came here. Let me know at least. I thought I'd make it a surprise. Also, you don't read my messages. Oh, <laughs> you're right. No, but really, what do you want? You. No, I mean, no, open the door. June, you can't just show up at my house unannounced. Ugh, give me a second. Ugh, finally. He's so random. What was he thinking just showing up? I haven't really talked to him much since the cruise. And neither after the sleepover. Ugh, whatever. I don't owe him anything. He's not my boyfriend. Ugh, you know what? Let me just see what he wants. June, why are you here? Can you please inform me? Bella, like I said, I missed you. And I just wanted to see you. I mean, well, you could have just texted me that. Like, why would you assume that it's okay to just show up at my house at 10 p.m.? Like, what? Yeah, well... You called me like the other day and I thought that you wanted to hang out. June, I was at a sleepover with my friends and they dared me to prank call you with a weird Chad voice or whatever. Oh yeah, you did a funny voice. Did you like my impression? I also did a funny voice. I mean, it was kind of dumb funny. You kind of sound like a Chad. But to be honest, June, it was just a dare, okay? I, I didn't mean to call you. They, they, they told me to do it. That's why I did it. Otherwise, I would not have done that, okay? Ow. So you... Didn't really want to talk to me? Not really. And besides June, we've been over this. At the cruise, I told you I need time to think about everything, you know? You just showing up here isn't helping with that. So could you please just go away? Bella, look, I'm really sorry. And I know I hurt you. And it pains me to see you upset at me. I just really want to work things out. So please let me in. Just go home, June. It's late. Be Bella, it's raining. Okay. And what do you want me to do about that? Become Mother Nature and just control the weather for you so it stops raining? Okay, fine. If you really don't want me here, I guess... June, don't do that. I guess I'll go. I'm turning around now, walking slowly in the rain. Ugh, is he really trying to guilt trip me right now? Why is it working? I'm getting all wet now. I'm drenched. Fine. June, just come in. Really? I can come in? <laughs> no, I was joking. Oh. I'm kidding. Come on, get in. Hurry up before I change my mind. Ugh, you're like drenched. You're like a wet dog. You're gonna wet all my floors now. My bad. And yeah, I know. I was out there in the rain. Why would you come here in the middle of a rainstorm? Well, it wasn't boring when I got out of my house. Also, me coming here is important. What's so important to you? Also, give me a second. I need to turn on the lights. We're like bats in the dark. <sighs> Much better. Hi. Uh, hi? Why are you so close to me? You probably have cuties. Space out a little bit. My bad. I'm just cold, you know? If you want, you can go to my bathroom upstairs and grab a towel or something to dry off. I wouldn't want you to get sick or something. Really? I mean, yeah. I care about you. I don't want you to freeze to death or something. You really mean that? Never mind. Don't do anything then. Just freeze to death. <laughs> You're so mean. Fine, I'll go to the bathroom. Okay then. Wait, hold on. Where's your bathroom? It's upstairs. Um, first door to the right. This is my left and this is my right. Bro, do you really not know your left and right? <laughs> <sighs> she doesn't even have towels in here. Let me check somewhere else. Maybe there's some towels in here. Wow, this is Bella's room? That's so cute. Aw, I remember seeing this back when we used to call in FaceTime. Man, her room smells so good. It smells just like her, like watermelon and vanilla. Why is he taking so long? My house isn't that big. Uh, June, did you find the towels? Uh, June, is everything okay? Uh, June? Why is he not in the bathroom? Wait a second. Oh, he better not be in my room. I think I left my diary open. Please don't be in my room. Please don't be in my room. Uh, June, what are you doing in my room without me knowing? Oh, hi. Um, just looking for some towels. Um, were there not any in the bathroom? Did you not check? Yeah, I did check the bathroom and there wasn't any. Sorry. Oh, that's my bad. I'll get you some right now. Okay, there we go. Um, I'm just gonna give you one of mine. Here you go, June, and take that jacket off. You're wetting my floors. Thanks. Appreciate it. Also, wait a second. Isn't that the jacket from her first date? You still have this? Uh, yeah, probably. I mean, all I remember on her first date was me being shirtless. Wait, yeah, I just remembered you were shirtless. What the heck? Why were you shirtless on a first date? That's so player of you. To be honest with you, I don't really know. And also, you didn't seem to mind. Oh, whatever. I mean, you do have some nice bread to gab. So, you shouldn't be doing that. It's giving red flag energy no whatever it's it's not like i go on dates anymore wait what do you mean i thought you still were working for that hire a boyfriend website thing <laughs> yeah i stopped doing that wait what you did when why yeah i quit ever since we started going out wait actually because of me yeah i realized what i was doing was kind of weird and you think well actually I, I can't really be talking remember when you paid me 500 that was my lucky day not because you gave me 500 and because i met you oh shut up you simp you ghosted me if anything i feel stupid for not realizing what a red flag your background was hey what are you talking about i'm a green flag look at me oh wait i'm wearing red never mind 
And besides, you know, if I never did that job, we probably would have never met. So I'm kind of glad. Um, was that before or after breaking my heart, knowing that I really liked you? Hey, Bella. You're getting too close. My bad. Force of habit. Also, look, Bella, I'm sorry, okay? Can we just move past that? Dude, you don't even understand how much I liked you, and it took me quite a while to start getting over you. You showing up at my house randomly isn't helping. Well... Not completely, you know, because we did have some good times together. Yeah, but June, the past is in the past. Yeah, exactly. So forgive me. June, it's not that easy. You say you're sorry, but how do I know you're not going to just do that again and hurt me? I need to really think about everything, okay? Isn't that what you said at the cruise when I tried to kiss you? Why would you even bring that up? Because we almost made out. I mean, kiss. Oh, shut up. Now is not the time to be joking around. Can you just hurry up and dry off and take that jacket off? You keep wetting my floor. Okay, fine, fine. Wait a second. Since when did June started getting so muscular. He looks pretty good. Ugh, what am I saying? I should be thinking out of him. What are you looking at? Uh, nothing. I'm not looking at anything. I'm just admiring um the view. Oh, look, it stopped raining. <laughs> right. Uh, Bella, get a grip. Stop being such a simp. Anyways, come here, Bella. Uh, what? Uh, what? Why? Bella, I have a gift for you. You have a gift for me? Bro, what are you, Santa Claus? Well, I am wearing red, and it's almost Christmas, so why don't we start early? You really think you're smooth, huh? Let me see the gift. It's a necklace. Let me put it on you. Come here. Oh my gosh, why is he so close to me? This is really not helping me move on. Also, oh my gosh, he smells so good. Why do men's cologne make me full? There you go. You like it? It's a letter B? Yeah, B for Boone. Boone? What the heck is that? This looks like a dog's name. Boone for, you know, Bella and June. Bella and June forever. Yeah, and if that doesn't last, then it's B for Bella. Let's go. Um, thank you, June. I appreciate the gift. Well, I'm glad you like it. Now that you're wearing it, you want to take a picture? A picture? What are you, the paparazzi? You know what? Let's just do it. Oh, look at that. We look cute together. We do look pretty cute. But anyways, don't post that picture, okay? And also, June, it's getting late, so um, I really think you should start heading out. I'm tired. I have to go to sleep. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I just I just missed you. I wanted to ask you if you wanted to hang out sometime. What do you mean, hang out? Are you asking me on a date? Well, it doesn't have to be a date, but if you want it to be, I don't mind. June, <sighs> I don't think I can be going on dates with you. And besides, we're just friends or acquaintances, I, I guess. guess. I don't know. Well, what about a friendly date then? You know, like as friends, it doesn't have to be anything more. I mean, I, I guess. Like, I don't know. You're so annoying. Out of all of my friends, why would I want to hang out with you? Me. Annoying. Yes, you. You're very annoying. So is that a yes? Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. But what I do know is that it's late and you should get out of my house. So bye. Good night. Okay, fine. I guess I'll see you this week. If I say yes, do you promise you're not going to ghost me or cancel last minute and not show up? I won't. I promise. Like and subscribe for more episodes. Yeah, do it. I want to go on a date with her. I mean, a friendly date. A wink.